Welcome viewers. Today we are going to start with exercise 9.5 of class 8 mathematics, algebraic expression and identities. Identity is derived from identical. That means an expression which is identical to another expression. It is also known as formula. Formula means a universally correct statement. So, suppose we have a plus b whole square. This is an expression and identical to this is a square plus b square plus 2ab and this equation becomes an identity or a formula. Similarly, a minus b whole square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2ab. This is also an identity or a formula. Another frequently used identity in al algebraic expression is a plus b into a minus b. This is equal to a square minus b square. One more identity we will be dealing with in this chapter is a or x plus a into x plus b is equal to x square plus a plus b into x plus a b. Clear? So these are all identities or formula of algebraic equation. Question number one. Use a suitable identity to get each of the following products. So x plus 3 into x plus 3. We have to find the product. So we can write this as x plus 3 whole square. And this is a and this is b. We have just learned the identity. a plus b whole square is equal to a square. So we can write this as a square that is x square plus b square in this case 3 square plus 2 a into b that is 2 into x into 3 and this is equal to x square plus 9 plus 6 x with the use of identity, this discerning the product of these two expressions become much easier. Second question, same a plus b into a plus b. So we write it as a plus b whole square. This is equal to a square that is 2y square plus b square that is 5 square plus 2 into a into b. We get the result as 4y square plus 25 plus 24 into 5 20y. Same way, we can write this as a minus b whole square. So in this case, 2a minus 7 whole square. And this is equal to a square, in this case, 2a square plus b square, that is 7 square, minus 2 into a into b. So we get the result as 4 a square plus 49 minus 4 into 7 28 a clear so in this case we write it as this is a and this is b again minus this is a and this is b straight away we use the identity 
a minus b whole square. So let's write this as 3a minus 1 by 2 whole square. So we get the result as 3a square plus half square minus 2ab that is 3a into 1 by 2. So we have here 9 9 a square plus 1 by 4 minus 3 a this is a and b again a and b but here it's minus and it's plus we have learned a minus b into a plus b is equal to a square minus b square so we write this as 1.1 m square minus 0 0.4 square we get the result as 1.21 m square minus 4 square 16 0 0.16 I repeat again, we have learned this is A, so A is minus B, this is B, into A plus B. This is equal to A square minus B square. Same, we have applied. Clear? Here we have a plus b. In fact, this is square. Okay, a plus b, and here minus a square plus here b as b square. We can write this as b square plus a square. We we'll just interchange the position, and here also b square minus a square interchange the position. Now, this is, we consider this to be A, this to be B, and this to be A, this to be B. We have just seen A plus B, A plus B. Okay, so that's for better understanding, A plus B, and here A minus B. We are dealing this way. So we get A square minus B square. So, in this case, A is b square so b square square of that and a minus b square in this case b is a square so this is equal to b to the power 4 20 to 4 minus a to the power 4 clear so in this question this is a and this is b again this is a and this is b. So we have a minus b into a plus b. So you state a writer. This as 6x is a. So square of a minus square of b. That is 7 square. a minus b into a plus b is equal to a square minus b square. So, we have 36x square minus 49. In this case, we have minus a as a plus b as c. Again, a plus b. So, we write this as minus a plus c whole square. a plus b whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus 2 into a into b. So we have here minus a into minus a, a square plus c square this minus 2ac. Clear? 
So in this case, this is a plus b into a plus b. So we write this as 2x x by 2 plus 3y by 4 whole square. This is equal to a square that is x by 2 square plus b square that is 3y by 4 square plus 2 into a into b. So we have the values as x square by 4 plus 9y square by 16 plus 3xy by 4. You can further simplify but this expression is the result of this. This is we write here a minus b a minus b. So we have a minus b whole square. This is equal to a square plus b square minus 2 into a into b. So we have the result as 49 a square plus 81 b square minus 2 into 7, 14, 14, 9 is a 1, 26 a b. Clear? Question number two. We have to use this identity to find the products of this expression. x plus a into x plus b is equal to x square plus a plus b x plus a b. So, in this x is of course x and a is 3, b is 7. So, we write this as x square plus a plus b that is 3 plus 7 into x plus a b that is 3 into 7. So we get the values as x square plus 10x plus 21. In this case we have x square that is 4x square x square plus a plus b a is 5 b is 1 that is 5 plus 1 into x that is 4x plus a b that is 5 into 1 so we have the result as 16 x square plus 6 into 4, 24 x plus 5. In this case, we have x square. So this is x and minus 5 is a and b is minus 1. So we write this as 4 x square. plus a plus b a in this case is with a minus sign so we have a is minus 5 plus b that is minus 1 this whole into x in this case is 4x and plus a into b that is minus 5 into minus 1 so we get the result as 16 x square we have here minus 5 plus minus minus 1 so we have minus 6 and 6 into 4 that is 24 but with a minus sign so minus 24 x and plus 5 minus 5 into minus 1 is plus 5 clear 
So, we can write this as 4x plus 5 into 4x plus minus 1. So, in this case, a is 5 and b is minus 1. We give the result as 16, so 4x whole square plus a plus b, that is 5 plus minus 1. into x that is 4x plus a into b that is 5 into minus 1. This is equal to 16x squared and this is plus 4. 5 minus 1, 4. 4 into 4 is 16x plus this will be minus 5. So this Registered way as minus 5. In this case, we have x square that is 2x square plus a plus b that is 5y plus 3y. This into x that is 2x plus a into b that is. A here is 5y into b that is 3y. So we get the result as 4x square plus this is 8y into 2 that is 16y into x, x, y plus 15 y square. Clear? In this case, we have x is 2a square. So x square is 2a square full square plus a is 9, b is 5 into 2a square plus 9 into 5 a into b so we have 4 a to the power 22 4 plus 9 plus 5 is 14 into 2 that is 28 and we have a square plus 5 nines are 45 in this case we have a x as x, y, z. So, x, y, z square. x square is x, y, z square plus a plus b. a in this case is minus 4 and b is minus 2. So, we write this as a that is minus 4 plus b that is minus 2 and we multiply with x y z and plus a b that is minus 4 into minus 2 so we have the result as x square y square and z square here is minus 4 minus 2 is minus 6 so minus 6 x y z here minus 4 into minus 2 is plus 8 clear question number 3 find the following square by using the identities so in this case we'll use the identity a minus b whole square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2ab so, in this case, this is a. So, we'll write this is equal to b square and this is b. So, plus 7 square minus 2 into 
b into 7. So, this is equal to b square plus 49 minus 14b. In this case, we'll use the identity a plus b whole square, which is equal to, this is a and this is b. This is equal to x, y, whole square, plus, this is b, 3, z, whole square, and plus 2 into a, that is x, y, into 3, z. This is equal to x square, y square, plus 9z square, plus 6xyz. In this case, we'll use a minus b whole square, which is equal to a square, plus b square, minus 2 a into b this is equal to 36 x to the power 4 plus 25 y square minus 12 pizza 16 x square y Clear? So, in this case, A is 2m by 3. So, that is A square plus B square, that is 3m by 2 plus 2 into A. into B. So you have 4 n square by 9 plus 9 n square by 4 plus 2 n n. In this case, a is 0 0.4 p plus 0 0.5 q is b so this is a square plus b square minus 2 into a that is 0 0.4 p into b that is 0 0.5 q so this is 0.16 p square plus 0.25 q square minus this is 20 0.2 into 2 is 0.4 p q. In this case, A is 2xy whole square plus B 5y whole square plus 2 into x, 2 into 2xy that is A into B that is 5y. So we have this as 4x square y square plus 25 y square plus 4 into 5 20 x y square clear we have used a plus b whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab similarly a minus b whole square we have got minus 2ab again a plus b whole square and this is equal to a square plus b square plus to a B. Question number four. In this case, we'll use the identity 
a minus b whole square which is, which is equal to a square plus b square minus 2 into a into b we get the result as a to the power 4 plus b to the power 4 minus 2 a square b square in this case we have decided this expression as a plus b whole square and this as a minus b whole square so let's do this one and then we'll do this one with the negative sign so this one a is 2x that is 2x whole square plus b that is 5 square plus 2ab plus 2 into 2x into 5 and we have a minus here and we put a bracket and again this is a minus b so we have 2x whole square plus b that is 5 square and minus 2 a 2 into a into b and we close this bracket so we get the values as 2x this as 4x square plus 25 plus 4 into 5 20 x and this has what a minus operation so we get this as minus 4x square this minus 25 this is minus minus plus 4 into 520x this is equal to this 4x square this is minus 4x square so this is 0 this is plus 25 this is minus 25 again 0 so we're left out with 2x sorry 20x plus 20x so we get the value as this is 2 into 20x that is 40x which is the answer in this case this is a minus b whole square so we write this as 7m square plus 8n square minus 2 into 7m into 8n and we have another expression in this case we have plus 7m square this and a plus 8n square and a plus 2 into 7m into 8n now we have this as minus and this is plus so this is going to be zero so we get the result as 7 m that is 49 m square plus 64 m square this is zero plus 49 m square plus 64 m square now we get the result as this is m square 49 m square plus 49 m square so we have 98 m square this is 64 m square n square plus 64 n square so we, we have here 128 n square clear so in this case we have a is 4m so this is a square and b is 5n square
square plus 2 into 4 m into 5 m and this is plus 5 m square plus 4 m square and plus 2 into 5 m into 4 m so we have the values as 16 m square plus 25 n square plus 8 5 40 m and plus 25 m square plus 16 n square plus 40 m n so we get the result as M square so this is 16 and this is 25 m square this is 16 plus 25 that is 41 m square this is 25 plus 16 again okay. this is n square so plus 41 n square left out with this was 40 okay we missed the 40 so 40 mn and again this is 40 mn so we can have plus 80 n m this we can write as this is a and this is b and the whole square with minus so 2.5 p square plus 1.5 q square minus 2 into 2.5 p into 1.5 q and we have a minus here this is 1.5 p square a this is plus b in this case is 2.5 q square and we have a minus 2 into 1.5 p into 2.5 q so we write this as this is p square and 25 square is 625 that is 6.25 p square plus 15 square is 25 so this is 2.25 q square and we have got a minus here so this is 25 into 250 is 5 and this is 1.5 that is to get this as 7.5 and we have here p q open the bracket so you get a minus 15 square 225 2.25 p square with a minus again a minus 6.25 q square minus minus plus so we have this is 50 and same we have calculated in this case this will be minus minus plus so plus 7.5 a p and a q we solve further we have p square so we have here 625 and p square and 2.25 so you get a 625 minus 225 2.25 6.25 minus 2.25 so we get this as 4 and a p square same way, we'll have a minus 4 q square and we'll have this nullified with this. So this will be our result. Clear? So we write this as a square plus b square plus 2ab. 
minus. So we get this as a square b square plus b square c square plus 2 a b square c minus 2 a b square c nullifies so we are left out with a square plus b square plus b square c square we write this as m square whole square in this case a plus n square m square that is b minus 2 into m square a into b that is n square m and this plus 2 m cube n square this we get m to the power 4 plus n to the power 4 m square minus 2 this is m square into m that is m cube and this m square we have plus 2 m cube n square so this one this one is 0 so we get the value as m to the power 4 plus n to the power 4 into m square clear question number 5 we have to show that left hand side is equal to right hand side so we can write this as 9x square plus 49 that is 7 square plus 2 into 3x into 7 and here it will be minus 84x and this can be written as 9x square plus 7 square that is 49 minus 2 into 3x into 7 so we get this as 9x square plus 49 this is 6 into 7 that is plus 42 x and this is minus 84 x and this is equal to 9 x square plus 49 minus 6 into 7 that is 42 x so we get this as 9x square plus 49 minus 42 84 minus 42 that is 42 x and this is equal to right hand side that is 9x square plus 49 minus 42 x similarly this can be written as 9 square 81 p square plus 25 q square minus 2 into 9 into 5 that is 45 into 2 that is 90 p q and this is 180 p q and this side will have 81 p square plus 25 q square plus 2 into 9 into 5 that is 90 p q so we have 81 p square plus 25 q square this is plus 90 pq 180 minus 90 and this is equal to 
81 p square plus 25 q square plus 90 p q. So we have proven that left hand side is equal to right hand side. Clear? So we can write the left hand side as a minus b whole square that is a square that is 16 m square divided by 9 plus 9 n square divided by 16 minus 2 into 4 by 3 m into 3 by 4 n. So taking on left hand side only we are left out with and here we have got a plus 2 m n. So this is equal to 16 m square by 9 plus 9 n square by 16 and this is minus 2 m n and we have here plus 2 m n so the left hand side is equal to 16 m square by 9 plus 9 n square by 16 and this is minus 2 mn and plus 2 mn that is 0 and this is equal to the right hand side that is 16 by 9 m square plus 9 by 16 n square so we have proven that left hand side is equal to right hand side So we can write the left hand side is equal to 4 p q square that is 16 p square q square plus 9 q square plus 2 into 4 p q into 3 q and we have here another a minus 16 p square q square plus 9 q square minus 2 into p q 4 p q 4 p q into 3 q get this as 16 p square q square and plus 9 q square plus 8 into 3 24 p q square minus 16 p square q square minus 9 q square minus minus plus 8 into 3 24 p q square so minus 16 p square q square and plus 16 p square q square is 0 similarly 9 q square 9 q square is again 0 so we are left out with 24 plus 24 that is 48 p q square this is left hand side and this is, is equal to the right hand side that is 48 p q square this is right hand side so we've proven that left hand side is equal to right hand side so we have to prove that this expression is equal to 0 we know that a minus b into a plus b is equal to a square minus b square so we'll consider the left hand side so we'll get this as a square minus b square this part and similarly we'll have a plus here and this will be b square minus c square c 
similarly a plus and this will be c square minus a square so we have this as a square here minus a square plus b square minus b square and plus c square minus c square and this will be equal to zero and our right hand side is also zero clear question number six using identities evaluate so try to find value of 71 square so 71 can be written as 70 plus 1 square and this is a plus b whole square so we apply the identity we get the value as 70 square plus 1 square plus 2 into 70 into 1 this is equal to 70 square that is 4900 plus 1 plus this is 7 into 2 14 and 140 so we add this up this is equal to 0 so we have got 1 0 1 so we'll get 1 here and a 4 here and a 0 here So this is our answer. Similarly, 99 square can be written as 100 minus 1 is 99 whole square. And this is equal to 100 square plus 1 square minus 2 into 100 into 1. So we have the value as 100 square is 10,000 plus 1 minus 200. So we have the value as 10,000 minus 200 plus 1. So we'll have first this, we have 1, and this will be 0, and this will be 10 minus 2, 8, and a 9 here. So we'll have the result as 9,801. Similarly, we can write this as 100 plus 2 whole square. This is equal to 100 square plus 2 square plus 2 into 100 into 2. This is equal to 10,000 plus 4 plus 400. So we'll have the value as 400 plus 10,000, 10,404. Clear? So we can write this as 1000 minus 2 whole square. This is equal to minus plus 4 minus 2 into into 2. So we get the value as 4 minus 4,000 and this is equal to 4. This 4 in the unit place and we have 0, 0 and a 6. This is equal to 5 plus 4 square. This is equal to 5 square, that is 25, plus 0.2 square, that is 0 0.04, plus 2 into 5 into 0.2. This is equal to 25 plus 0 
0 0.04 plus 10 into 0.2 that is 2 and this is equal to 27.04 you can write this as 297 can be written as 300 minus 3 and multiply with 300 plus 3 we know that a minus b into a plus b is equal to a square in this case 300 square minus b square that is 3 square so we get the value as 9 minus 9 so this is equal to 1 So, we can write 78 as 80 minus 2 into 82 as 80 plus 2. So, we have this as a minus b into a plus b. So, we have here a square, 80 square minus b square that is 2 square. So, we have the values as 6, 4, double 0, minus 4. So, this is equal to 6, 9, 3, and 6. 8.9 can be written as 8 plus 0 0.9 whole square. This is equal to a square, that is, 8 square, that is 64, plus 0.9 square, that is 0.8. Plus 2 into 8 into. So we have the values as 64 plus 81 plus 144. That is. So we add this up. We get it as 1. Two, point, one carat. So we have here nine, four plus four, eight plus one, nine, and here six plus one, seven. We can write this as ten plus zero point five into ten minus zero point five. A plus B into A minus B. So we have here 10 square minus 0 0.5 square. This is equal to 100 minus 0 0.25. And this is equal to 99.75. Clear? Question number 7. Using A square minus B square is equal to A plus B into A minus B. We have to find values of these. So we can write 51 as 50 plus 1 and square minus 49 as 50 minus 1 square. So we have A here as 50 and B as 1. So we can write this as a plus b whole square that is a square 50 square plus b square plus 2 into 50 into 1 and a minus here then 50 square plus 1 square and here minus 2 into 50 into 1 a square plus b square minus 2 a so, we get the values as 50 square plus 1 square is straight away at the values. So, here we'll have 25 plus 1 plus 100 minus 
50 square minus 1 plus this is 100 minus minus plus so this is 0 and minus 1 plus 1 again 0 so we are left off with 100 plus 100 that is 200 in this case we can write 1.02 as 1 plus 0 0.02 whole square and 0.98 as 1 minus 0 0.02 whole square. So this is 1, 1 is A and 0 0.02 is B, similarly this is A minus B. So we solve this, we will get the values as A square plus B square plus 2 into A into B and minus here and this will be A square plus square minus 2 into 1 into 0 0.02. We have this one here, we have plus zero point three four square of point zero two plus two into this will be point zero four minus one plus sorry, this will be minus. So minus 0 0.0004 plus minus minus plus. So we are left out with 1 minus 1 0 plus 0 0.0004 and here this is minus and this is 0 0.04 plus 0 0.04 that is this is 0 0.08. Okay. So we can write one fifty three as one fifty plus three whole square minus one fifty one forty seven as one fifty minus three whole square. We have the values as one fifty square plus three square plus two into one fifty into and here the minus and we have 150 square plus 3 square minus 2 into 150 into 3 150 square that is 225.00 plus 9 plus this is 15 to the 30 these are 90 and we have 900 minus we have 150 square that is 225 double zero and here a minus 9 and here minus minus plus 900 so we are left out with this is minus 225 this is plus 225 0 9 gone minus 9 so we are left out with 900 plus 9 that is 1800 in this case we can write this as 10 plus 2.1 whole square minus 10 minus 2.1 whole square we write this as 10 square plus 2.1 square plus 2 into 2.1 into that is a 10 and this is minus 10 square plus 2.1 square minus 2 into a that is 10 into 2.1 so we get the values as this is 100 this is 
plus 21 square is 41. So we have 4.41 plus here we have 21 into 2 that is 42 minus 100 minus 4.41 and here plus 42. So we have here minus 25 by minus 125 by plus 100. This is again 0. So we are left out with 42 plus 42 that is 84. Clear? Question number 8. Using the identity x plus a into x plus b is equal to x square plus a b x plus a b we have to find these values. So we can write 103 as 100 plus 3 and 104 as 100 plus 4. So we have here x as 100 and a as 3 and b as 4. So we get the value as x square that is 100 square plus a b that is 3 plus 4 into x that is 100 plus a into b that is 3 into 4 so this is equal to 10,000 plus this is 7 into 100 700 plus this is 12 so we get the result as this is 712 and result as Going on to this one, we can type 5.1 as 5 plus 0 0.5 plus 0.1 and 5.2 as 5 plus 0 0.2. So we have here x as 5, a as 0.1 and b as 0.2. So we get the values as x square, that is 5 square and plus a a plus b x that is 0 0.1 plus into x that is 5 plus a b a into b that is so we get this values as 25 plus this is 0.3 into 5 that is 1.5 plus this is 0 0.02 so we add them up 25 26.5 so we have here 26.5 and this is 0 to added to it so 0 to clear so in this case we write 103 as 90 plus 13 and 98 as 90 plus 8. So we have this in form of x plus a into x plus b. So we write 90 square x square is 90 square plus a plus b that is 13 plus 8 a plus b into x that is 90 plus a b that is 13 into 8 so we get the result as 90 square is one double zero 13 plus is 8 is 21 so 21 into 9 so we have here 9 plus 13 into 8 so we add them up we have answer as 4 9 0 case we write 9.7 as 90 9, sorry, 9 
plus 0 0.7 and this as 9 plus 0 0.8 we have in this form of x plus a into x plus b so we have here x square as 9 square plus a plus b that is 0 0.7 plus 0 0.8 x that is 9 plus 0 0.7 that is a into so this is 81 plus this is 1.5 that is 15 into 9 that is 135 and we have 13.5 plus this is 0.7 into 0.8 that is 56 and we have here 0 0.56 so add them up 81 so we'll have here 0 0.56 plus 0 0.8 plus 56 and a 0 here one carat Plus one, five plus one, four two five, and here we have one plus eight that is nine. So we have the value as ninety five point zero six. Clear.